So, summary is very important, dear friends. How to summarize? You have done all the hard work, but the last one minute is very crucial. So, uh, what I'll say is, this is the icing on the cake when you end your presentation. Because that, understand, if you are not uh, passionate about your presentation, about your topic, people will not be interested. So, this is all about my presentation. Oh, it was really nice talking to you people. Very supportive audience. I really enjoyed this presentation. Thanks a lot for your kind attention and your support. In future, I hope to see you soon. Goodbye, all of you. Thank you. So, uh, this brings to the end of my presentation and I'm sure all of you enjoyed the presentation. Thank you. So this is what happens with most of us. We give a nice presentation and the end we botch up. We aren't able to summarize. See, it's like you're just, uh, you know, jumping from the peak and you just end up abruptly and the audience is confused. Uh, they, they don't know uh, that it has ended. So, summary is very important, dear friends. How to summarize? You have done all the hard work, but the last one minute is very crucial. So, uh, what I'll say is, this is the icing on the cake when you end your presentation. That's very important. So, why to summarize? Understand, people forget. People forget. Do you remember a movie which started and which ended? Mostly, most of you, I mean, you don't remember what happened in the middle. At the beginning, we remember what happened. But at the end, we remember. But in between, what happened, we don't remember. So people forget. I mean, you are giving a presentation and people forget. So they need to be reminded. So this gives them more clarity. You get more clarity. Okay, so the presentation went through one, two, three, four steps. Yes, we got it. So that's the reason why summary is very important. So the audience will get a kind of glimpses now at the end, uh, highlights of how your presentation went through and what you explained them and how was the journey. And that is what in summary we have to explain that which I will show you about. So how to summarize? First thing, pause. Second thing, smile. And next is, say with passion. So you have finished your last slide and you say, Pause. Smile. And then you have to say, passion. It's very important. It, because understand, if you are not uh, passionate about your presentation, about your topic, people will not be interested. Look at this presentation, which I'm giving you currently. I'm very passionate about my profession. The psychology and, you know, the communication skills and emotional toughness and public speaking. I have selected this field not because there is money or something. I have selected this field because it's my passion. My heart sings here. So when you have a passion for your topic, you people can figure it out. People can feel it. And then you have to say, and that brings me to the end of my presentation. Let me give you a brief summary of what I have been talking about over the last few minutes or a couple of hours, whatever it is. And while saying this, you should have a good eye contact with everyone. And then you have to summarize something like this. So the summary, I will summarize my video series. As you know, all of you, we are, uh, you're watching all these videos and we started the journey and the summary should go in this way. So to summarize, first we have seen the psychology behind giving a nice presentation, what is the right mindset required. Then I told you about making very effective slides. And then the next slide, I mean the next point, which was very important, how to start the presentation, how to make your first impression. Then our journey was attention grabber. Then how to handle difficult questions. I hope all of you enjoyed that point. And then it was like, when you make a mistake, how to deal with those mistakes? Advanced phrases I told you about, which I'm sure all of you liked, and it added some value in you. 
And the next point was body language. I told you about effective body language. That, that postures and gestures I told you about. And then summary. How to summarize that is this video. And then I'll tell you about the best presentation from TED. So this is all about my presentation. Oh, it was really nice talking to you people. Very supportive audience. I really enjoyed this presentation. Thanks a lot for your kind attention and your support. In future, I hope to see you soon. Goodbye, all of you. Thank you. So in this way, you have to summarize, right? Of course, as I have said, needs more practice. In the comments, all of you, write down what are the different phrases which you can use at the end of your summary. Like I said, like it was pleasure talking to you all or you were a great audience, you can say, what are the different phrases which we can use at the end of our presentation? Write in the comment. Let us have a healthy discussion there. Come on, check here. Still one video is there. I will analyze the best presenters from TED. Okay, don't miss that video. Take care and rock your presentation. Bye-bye.